Okay, get your name and title. Yeah, Aaron Ponce, P-O-N-C-E. Uh, I'm the commanding officer of South Traffic Division. Uh, so can you tell us what happened? Yeah, we know today we received a call at about 12.05 p.m. this afternoon. And we do know uh, the Toyota you see behind me uh, was traveling uh, northbound. And we also know the truck was traveling here westbound. And there was a traffic collision. As you can see, the truck continued uh, westbound through the intersection. And uh, somewhere in there, unfortunately, hit a pedestrian who was either on the sidewalk or, or there in the vicinity. Um, that pedestrian has uh, uh, passed away here at scene, so our units from South Traffic Division are conducting investigation. We do know that the suspects were in the car. We believe there were three individuals in the car, but the driver fled the scene. Uh, we're conducting follow-ups at this time, and we're looking for the public's help uh, to identify anybody was in the area that could identify the driver and help us make a positive identification. Of course, they can remain anonymous. Uh, we do not release any information on uh, the driver or the uh, decedent until we can positively identify them and notify the next of kin. So right now we're starting our investigation. It'll be moving forward uh, as we go along this afternoon. So that's the information we have at this time. Uh, the individuals that were in the vehicle that were at scene uh, were not injured, so that's very fortunate. Uh, that there, uh, no one else was injured, but unfortunately we did lose uh, someone today due to this accident. I would just encourage everybody, really pay attention to the lights uh, and speed. Uh, we've seen an increase in accidents, an increase of severe accidents, and also um, uh, accidents result in a fatality. If you flee the scene, that is a felony. We will search for you and arrest you to bring, bring you into the criminal justice system. That is a felony to flee the scene and not render aid to someone that's injured, and especially if somebody dies. That is a felony. I want to emphasize that. So we need your help, public, to stay at scene and do the responsible thing, render aid, and stay until we can complete our investigation. How many suspects are you guys looking for? Well, we know uh, what we know is there was approximately three people, at least three people, from what we have reported, fled that. Of course, there is generally only one driver of a vehicle, so the driver is responsible for that. But we'd also be looking for the uh, other passengers as witnesses uh, to to this, as they're potential witnesses uh, to the incidents as they unfolded today. And, and you're not given a description of the people that flee. Uh, not at this time. The detectives are still uh, uh, putting that together, so to be accurate, I could come back in, in a little while and give you that information, but at this time, I do not have that information. The detectives behind me, as you can see, I'm sure do. I did not get that information at this time from them. And which vehicle did they flee? So they flo uh, fled the truck that's uh, down the street a bit, as okay. you can see in our uh, background. Okay. Thanks so much. Okay. Thank you very much. Any, uh, yeah, phone want to... If they do want to give information. So you can always call the uh, tip line, the WEED tip line, and you can always leave an anonymous tip at Crime Stoppers. Okay. So 1 800 Crime Stoppers, or you can log on and log on to Crime Stoppers and leave your information anonymously and it will re reach us. You can also call uh, South Traffic Division. Thanks, sir. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome.